Thank you, everyone. Thank you for being here. Uh, we're here tonight for a very special lecture by the 2018 Special Breakthrough Prize in Fundamental Physics winner, uh, Jocelyn Bell Bunnell. Um, and also joining us in the audience is the co-winner of the 2018 Nobel Prize in Physics, uh, Donna Strickland from the University of Waterloo. <laughs> <laughs> this is a very rare evening, as you clearly recognize, and it will be one to remember, I'm sure. Both Jocelyn and Donna made breakthrough discoveries as graduate students. Jocelyn discovered neutron stars, which are now providing us with a giant natural physics lab in the sky, as she'll explain. And Donna developed chirped pulse amplification, a revolutionary method of compressing laser light with wide applications from physics to medicine to industry. Both Donna and Jocelyn are passionate about physics, but also about explaining physics and encouraging young people to become physicists. So they're both being here with us tonight is an ideal opportunity to announce a new series of fellowships for young physicists. Each fellowship is named for an inspirational figure, and the memory of these people will, and the thought of them, will inspire us, and especially the holders of these fellowships, to pursue research as ambitious and path-breaking as theirs was. Well, three of these fellowships have so far been filled. The P. James E. Peeble Fellowship, Peebles Fellowships, is named for a legendary Canadian-American cosmologist at Princeton who pioneered much of modern cosmology, including the origin of the elements and the formation of galaxies. The first Peebles Fellow will be Matthew Madhavacharil from India. He's currently at Princeton, but he'll soon join us at Perimeter at our new Center for the Universe. The Yakov B. Zeldovich Fellowship is named for a Belarusian scientist who made extraordinary contributions to many areas, including physical chemistry, cosmology, and astrophysics. The first Zeldovich Fellow is Zen Pan, an outstanding new PhD from UC Davis, who's just joined us at the Center for the Universe. And please join me in congratulating Zen. The Francis Coffey Alotti Fellowship is named for a Ghanaian physicist and a dear friend of mine who made pioneering contributions to X-ray nuclear spectroscopy. In many ways, Francis led the development of physics in Africa, and he was the first patron of the African Institute for Mathematical Sciences, Ames, and a council member of the International Center for Theoretical Physics in Italy. He was a brilliant, wise person and a legendary mentor of young people. We commemorate him with the Alotti Fellowship at Perimeter and welcome the first holder, Estelle Meva Inak, a brilliant young Cameroonian working in quantum machine learning. Please join me in congratulating Estelle. We've got a few more named fellowships, not yet filled, to announce today. The Yvonne Shokwe Bruhat Fellowship is named, with her permission, for a pioneering French mathematical physicist. She proved that Einstein's famous equations for gravity actually have solutions. And, and that matters to mathematicians. <laughs> okay. It actually matters to all of us. The fellowship in her name will support a young researcher in gravity and mathematical physics. 
The Chin Shung Wu Fellowship is named in honor of the Chinese American nuclear physicist whose discovery of the violation of parity symmetry, so that the world is not the same as its image in a mirror, in, in the decays of atomic nuclei, is a cornerstone in our understanding of the weak interactions. The fellowship in her name will be awarded to an exceptional young particle physicist. The Stephen W. Hawking Fellowship is named for someone very familiar to us, a great friend and mentor of perimeters. Shortly before he died, Stephen graciously permitted us to name a fellowship in his honor. It's yet to be awarded, but it will be to a young cosmologist working on foundational ideas in cosmology. And last but not least, it's my honor to announce the Jocelyn Bell Burnell Fellowship at Perimeter, which she has generously agreed to lend her name to. The Jocelyn Bell Burnell Fellowship will support a young researcher who, like Jocelyn herself, tries to understand the universe by looking at it. And these are very exciting times to be looking at the universe and for radio astronomy in particular. And we are very fortunate at Perimeter to be closely involved. You will be hearing much more about this field. I've no doubt we shall find many fitting candidates for this fellowship. These seven named fellowships will bring early career scientists to Perimeter to pursue challenging questions at the forefront of physics. So please join me in celebrating both the fellowships and their namesakes, the people who helped pave the way for everything we do here. <laughs>